Hey crafters, I'm gonna show you how to make a paper flower. What you will need is a strip of car stock or um, designer paper cut at one and a half inches by 12. And you'll need your scallop punch and um, a scratch piece of the paper and a scoring tool. So to begin, you're just going to punch out your scallops on one side of the designer paper. You want to make sure you line it correctly. And then at the very end, just give it one more punch. Remove the excess paper, and then you have one scallop edge. I am using the Martha Stewart pouring board, and I love it. And the reason the reason I love it is because it has one eighth all the way down versus a score pal, which has just some here and there. So I'm going to score my designer paper at every half inch. Now that I've scored my paper at every half inch, so it's half inch, one, one and a half, and so on, all the way down to eleven and a half, I'm going to fold my paper in an accordion fold style. And you can use your bone folder to help with the creases. my bone folder and smooth out some of my creases. Okay, now we're going to use some red tape to adhere the two ends together. Now that I have my two ends adhere, I'm going to use a 3D pop-up dot on my scratch piece of paper. I'm going to prepare that because it's way easier to have this ready versus trying to do it after you pinch it. What you want to do is keep the scallops on the outside and kind of just push down and collect the scallops together. And sometimes you have to work with it because it, it may fight against you. Now that I have it pinched the way I like it, I'm going to pick it up and I'm going to stick it to my glue dot. And then I like to take my bone folder and run it in, in the valleys to make sure it's stuck to the glue dot because if not, it's going to pop out. And there's your scallop flower. The last thing to do, I'm going to take the word spooky from Wicked Coal and use my craft ink. Ink up my stamp. And then I'm going to use another scratch oval punch um, paper and stamp the word spooky. I'm going to take another 3D dot and stick one on the back and stick it to the center of my flower and this will go on my box that I'm, I'm going to make for my daughter's teachers. I hope you enjoy. Have a great day.